Hey, what's going on, everybody? I'm Akeem, and in today's Fix of Entertainment news, the Batverse is happening with Matt Reeves, Legion creator Noah Hawley's Alien series is moving forward, and some unfortunate news pertaining to Rick and Morty co-creator Justin Roiland. Let's drop it. All right, now the Batman director Matt Reeves is meeting with James Gunn and Peter Safran to explore the Batverse and the DCU. Now, apparently the two universes will be separate from each other with Robert Pattinson's Batman leading the charge. Now, speaking to Collider, Reeves explained, quote, we're just getting together to talk about all of that. Look, I'm excited to hear what they're going to do. The Batverse thing, as James has said, and as Peter has said, is kind of its own thing they're letting us do. Now, Reeves went on to mention how he'll be briefed on the DCU's 10-year plan and what's in store for the immediate future of the franchise, which will likely aid him in the direction he'll be taking the burgeoning Batman universe. Now, fortunately, we already know of a few developments like the Colin Farrell Penguin series and the Arkham Asylum series, as well as a sequel to the Batman film. We also heard news late last year that Matt Reeves is interested in exploring movies focused on Batman villains Clayface, Scarecrow, and a few others with different writers and directors presumably attached. Now this will likely be part of the larger conversation he'll be having with Gunn and Saffron. Honestly, really exciting news to hear about the upcoming Batverse. All right, now in other news, the upcoming FX original series set in the Alien universe is gearing up for production later this year. Now, Fargo showrunner Noah Hawley and Ridley Scott are set to helm the series, which will be a prequel to the original 1979 sci-fi movie. The series will reportedly be set on Earth about 70 years in the future with the group of survivors dealing with the spread of xenomorphs on the planet, which is a little confusing since that puts it before the events of Alien Covenant, but also undermines the fact that in the first two Alien movies, the aliens were, well, alien and not an established threat. But anyways, look forward to it happening at some point in time. And finally, and not so fun news, Rick and Morty co-creator Justin Roiland has been charged with domestic abuse and false imprisonment. The news comes from NBC, which obtained the criminal complaint, which states Roiland was charged back in May of 2020. Now, the incident in question occurred back in January of 2020. Now, the charges are coming from an anonymous Jane Doe he was dating, and he's pleaded not guilty to both domestic abuse and false imprisonment charges. A lot of details pertaining to the case are reportedly being withheld, but an attorney did tell NBC that a plea offer is on the table. Roland has been ordered to attend a hearing that will reconvene on April 27th. Now, considering how many different projects Roland is involved with, this news could have some widespread effects in the entertainment world. Now, we'll keep you posted as the story develops. And that about does it for your entertainment news for today. I'm Akeem, and thank you so much for watching. Now that you're caught up on today's episode, please check out our previous one. Download the IGN app on all your devices. And for everything else, stick with IGN.